use my coke. What's up guys? Today we are watching episode 2 of Breaking Bad. So, last episode, Walter found out that he had cancer. So that added on to the list of problems that he already has. And he decided to start dealing drugs with a former student of his, Jesse. Was it a smart idea? Probably not. But I'm not going to judge him because he needs the money. So... But I'm ready to know what happens, like, after, like, how last episode ended, because I just, <laughs> I thought they already got caught, and then they didn't. So, let's get into the episode. <laughs> Okay then. He still hasn't even told his wife that he has cancer. You are a lifesaver. Yeah, man. Yeah, we can't thank you enough. No, hey, mad, mad props. <laughs> And then I'm trying to read the map while I'm driving, which is a bonehead maneuver. And then all of a sudden, bam, we're we're in that ditch. Yeah, bam. I'm like, what the hell, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Jesse is just like not convincing. Can we just dump them here? What? Then somebody finds them? Then what? People have seen us. So then what do you plan on doing with them? Jesse doesn't even know he has cancer, right? Yes, okay. <laughs> so then they left a mask there. They're alive. <laughs> Walt? You coming out? Did he pass out in the bathroom? Yep. Yeah, absolutely. And Joan Epperman, you know Joan, suddenly has to go through all these photos and turn them down because they show Mm, sorry, that wasn't that funny. Yeah, I I'm good. Oh, Mr. White, this is AT and T calling. Are you happy with your uh, current long distance service? <laughs> if you're not, I would definitely really, really love to talk to you. Jesse. Hello, 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 hello. You said he was practically. Did you, man? Calling sick. Uh, listen, uh, that is just not going to work for me. I'm, I'm not interested in that at all. And uh, I would appreciate it if you don't call here anymore. I kind of feel bad that he's leaving Jesse to do that on his own. But, like, he does have a job. Yo, yo, yo. One, four, eight. Three to the three to the six to the nine. Representing the ABQ. <laughs> oh, my God. Now his wife is going to be so confused. For instance. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, for instance, uh, thalidomide. Oh, I thought he saw someone that just like messed up his train of thought. So, 
Yes, Ben. Is this gonna be on the murder? Hmm. Is this gonna be on the midterm? Oh. I'm finna take more stuff. <laughs> Shit. Unless he's in there. Who the hell was that? Was that one of the dudes in the RV? He has tape on his arm, so... <laughs> Is it really gonna tell? There's websites for that kind of shit that actually told you. Milfs. How is a milf? Oh my god. Crazy Eight. Crazy Eight? What the hell does that even mean? I don't know, man. Okay, it means like, like Crazy Eight. Okay, I don't know. What a good explanation. No, not him so much. What is his reputation for violence? Well, um, he <laughs> did try to kill us both yesterday, so there's that. What yeah. <laughs> He's a distributor, right? He's a... What? Do you think he is capable of listening to reason? Um, I don't know. Crazy eight. Hey, listen, if I let you go, will you... Why the hell did we talk about? I just realized that Jesse's eye has makeup on it now. What the hell are you doing? Seems like it might be better than tape. Man. Oh, hey, nerdiest old dude I know. You want to come cook Crystal? Please. I'd ask my diaper wearing granny, but her wheelchair wouldn't fit in the RV. I mean, but you also agreed to do it, so don't act like it's just his fault. What about the, uh, the, the, the phosphate gas? It would be chemical disincorporation. Dissolving in strong acid. Hmm. Well, if you gotta do that, then fucking do it. Where would you do that, though? Serious. In a scenario like this, I don't suppose it is bad form to just flip a coin. <laughs> He's gonna be that one. No, I'll, I'll do the the body and the acid. Okay. Oh. Heads or tails. I thought he was just. Yeah, I was about to say he's probably gonna be the one that has to deal with the actual body and the acid, but. It's like you were doing it anyway. That's two out of three. <laughs> oh, what kind of plastic, man? Polyethylene. Well, how the hell am I supposed to know that? Because I told you. Just look at the bottom. 
I don't know, man. This feels kind of flimsy. But any decent acid's gonna eat right through this. Not hydrofluoric. Why not? Got so many questions. Skipped. Just try and think of it like I was. I was doing him a favor. At least he tried to help. me up too much oh my god well you already touched it with your actual hand so now it's got your fingerprints He's going to suffocate him with the bag. <coughs> it wouldn't be smart to go near him because his hands and legs are also free, so... Bottom one still had crust. <laughs> He's about to smoke weed. <laughs> you smoking weed? Oh my god. Wait a minute, is that is that my weed? <laughs> Where else would he have gotten it from? Make yourself at home, why don't you? Go. Didn't do it. <laughs> you didn't do it? You didn't buy the bins. Hey man, we flipped a coin! We flipped a coin! Didn't matter. You remember you said that when she's 16 and starts dating. <laughs> Looking fabulous. Let me see if they're done with the blood sugar, then we'll get you out of here. I'll be right back. He's not gonna make it to when she's 16. Who is Jesse Pinkman? Yeah, caught. Last night until two in the morning, you don't tell me where you've been. You spent the entire night in the bathroom, Walt. Tell me what's going on with you. Is she gonna tell, well, is he gonna tell her about his cancer now? He sells me pot. So right now. What I need is for you to climb down out of my ass. Can you do that? Damn. Do that me, Will you please? I didn't expect this. Just once. Powder! Take a powder, go on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm lucky surprised he hasn't went down there because he tends to do the opposite of what he's axed of. He's really doing that in the middle of the day and Walt's wife just showed up. Look, lady, whatever you're selling, I ain't buying, yo. Well. My name is Skylar White, yo. My husband is Walter White, yo. Um... He told me everything. Seriously? 
do not sell marijuana to my husband. Okay. I mean it. Don't call our house again. You stay away from I feel like I heard this. One sorry Was this like a famous sound on TikTok or something? I don't know. Yeah, I think so, yeah. At least she didn't see the body. <laughs> Why are you trying to bring it upstairs? I'm gonna do that shit in your bathtub. And yeah, the killer in the basement, the one who's completely my responsibility. Hell, let's just let him live down there. I feel like something's not going to go right. Feed him like three times a day. <laughs> oh. 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 I really don't think it was a good idea to do it in your house. But then again, where else did you y'all plan on doing it? You want to go there? Try dragging 200 pounds of stink up a flight of stairs. I barely got him in the bathtub. Bathtub? What? What do you mean? He wasn't supposed to do it in the bathtub. In the bins. They were gonna do it in the bins. I forgot. Oh shit. I'm sorry, what were you asking me? Oh, yes. That stupid <laughs> plastic container I asked you to buy. <laughs> it will, however, dissolve metal. They're gonna find the mask. I'm sorry, why was the first thing you did, like, just put it on? I would've just left that shit. <laughs> Since Jesse did that, now he has to clean up so much shit in his house because it just, <laughs> it fell through. He needs to just he needs to actually start listening to Walt, but I don't know. <laughs> I really can't believe that happened. I didn't even think about that. I didn't even know that could happen, but Walt did. Yet he didn't tell Jesse though, so kind of, that's still on Walt. He didn't know that that shit could happen. But then that's also why he told him to get the plastic bins. Yet, Jesse didn't, so. <laughs> the wife, though. The wife, though, is kind of. I'm kind of mixed emotions with her because I like her. But then she's also trying to control what Walt does. And it's like. What's the problem with him smoking a little weed? She acts like it alters his whole personality. When it doesn't, I don't know, she kind of just like made me mad with that because he, she has been up his ass. But then again, Walt hasn't even told her yet about the cancer. It's like, how is that going to come up? When is he going to tell her? Because right now, it seems like she's, he's not even going to tell her like anytime soon. Watch her find out from like his doctor calling and then like mentioning it to her. 
And then she's like, what the fuck are you talking about? Probably not, but <laughs> that's just what I'm going to say is going to happen. I swear. <laughs> I, how are they going to clean all of that up? Because that's literally a whole body that's like decomposed or whatever. It was still blood and organs and shit. <laughs> and that's just nasty. And it's going to stain his floor. Like how is he going to get the smell out? <sighs> Jesse, Jesse has to worry about so much more now that he fucking did that. But then they still have to worry about the dude downstairs. So, like, what are they gonna do with him? Walt was just gonna freaking suffocate him with the fucking plastic bag over his head. But didn't because he woke up. Gave him a whole fucking feast, too. Gave him a sandwich, two things of water, Germex, a bucket, and toilet paper. But I mean, that makes sense, because, like, what do you expect the dude to do? Like, shit on himself? Then you'd have to help him clean up, because they're not gonna, like, take the thing off so he can clean up himself. So. <laughs> I'm ready to see what they do next episode, because... <laughs> Jesse cracks me up too much, and the fact that he did that still kind of blows my mind. But I'm ready to see how that... Like, how they clean that up. Or maybe it'll just jump until after they clean it up. I don't know. But we'll see. So, come back for episode three. <laughs>